Hi everyone, welcome to day five of Vlogmas. If you're new here, my name is Megan. I do sewing, embroidery, and other crafty things. And in today's video, it is going to be a quick tutorial on Embrillate's Essentials and how to change your hoop perimeters, also known as your hoop settings. Um, so you know how big you want your design to be based on the perimeters to make sure that everything fits in, would fit into your hoop. So this is a pretty simple step. So let me just show you how to do this. So this is the perimeters that I set myself for my eight by nine inch mighty hoop. I always make sure I make it a bit smaller than this hoop so that I can make sure that it will fit it when I upload it to my machine. Now to change this, let's say if I wanted to change it to another hoop size, for example, if I'm changing to my um, Brother NQ1600E embroidery machine, which can only go up to six by 10, I would go to Embrilliance, click Preferences, and as you can see, I already have some preset hoop sizes that I created myself, um, but you can create your own hoop sizes here as well. You can also preset what file type you want to save it to. Since I have my Rakoma, it's for DST, and my brother machine is PES, so I usually just kind of leave it like, like it is. Now to create a new hoop size, so for example, if I wanted to create a five by five inch hoop size, I would go click new. You would name it. So as you can see for my others, I named my hoop sizes based off of um, obviously how big the hoops are. So for example, the 11 by 13, I know that's for my 11 by 13 inch mighty hoop. Same with the four by four, the six by 10, et cetera, et cetera. Now, as you can see here, after I would name it, you would want to convert the, um, in the US we use inches, so you wanna convert that to millimeters and enter that here. Um, so let's just say I created a new design and I click save. Then to change it, let's say if I wanted to go to my 11 by 13 inch hoop, if I wanted it to apply to this specific page, I would click apply. And as you can see, it completely changed. So now it has changed to my 11 by 13 inch mighty hoop size. So I hope you guys found this tutorial helpful. I know it was a quick and easy video. Um, I'm planning on posting more videos about Embrillance Essentials. And like I said in my uh, liner there that I do sewing, embroidery, and other crafty things, um, including uh, tutorials on Embrillance Essentials and embroidery. And as you can tell, it is day five of Vlogmas, so I'm planning on vlogging every single day up until Christmas time. So if you guys like anything crafty, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing giving this video a thumbs up, and leave a comment down below if there are any tutorials that you would like to see, um, not only in Embrilliance, but anything else crafty. So I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye!